voilà Bye Hi there, I'm Ru, and this video is so overdue. In today's video, I want to thank my secret Santa. I actually love making Reddit gifts, unboxing, thank you videos, but I just haven't been doing them lately, even though I have been participating in exchanges. So if you've been a Santa of mine, and you haven't seen a video, I'm, I'm very sorry. It's not because I wasn't thankful or didn't want to make a video, it's just... I've had a lot on my plate. But now I'm making them, so I'm really excited to show you what my wonderful Santas got me. Today I want to show you what my original Santa in the original Secret Santa exchange got me. So the original Secret Santa exchange is the first exchange that Reddit Gifts ever did. And they had that for a couple of years and then they ex expanded into having exchanges all the time. But the original one is the one during Christmas. It's, you know, the original, actual Secret santa for Christmas. So my gift came in this adorable little parcel which looked so Harry Potter-esque, it's amazing. I'm not saying that Hagrid or someone at Hogwarts had a hand in packaging my parcel, but a girl can dream. And it also came from the UK, so even more mysterious and magically coincidental. In my package, there were two things, a chocolate bar and a bag. The chocolate bar was a dark chocolate, I'm going to post know, edit something in here so you see what it looked like. It was a chocolate bar with uh, a dark chocolate and raspberries, which are two of my favorite things, dark chocolate and raspberries. And I feel like my Santa went out of their way to try to find something vegan for me, so I'm really happy about that. And somehow they were psychic enough to know exactly what kind I wanted, which I had not provided them any information about. Even more magical. Mysterious. Now what kind of bag would fit into a tiny parcel? <laughs> this bag. No, it's not a top. It really isn't. Maybe you could like, in an emergency maybe? See, it has so many uses. It's got one big compartment and it's got two adorable compartments where you can put your phone and your keys so you don't have to stand there in the store frisking your own bag to try to find stuff. That's happened. Comment below if it's happened to you too. It's really amazing because when you don't use it, you can just fit it in the palm of your hand or AK in your pocket and such. I have small hands, okay? But you get the point. You can fit into the palm of your hand. So you don't have to like lug around a bunch of bags that are empty when you don't use them. And then when you do need them, you just go voila, bug. What's really nice about this, because I feel like my Santa really took into consideration the fact that I'm a vegan and I'm an environmentally conscious, politically interested person, and I'm a feminist, because I wrote that. And I feel like they really took that into account when they got me this bag, because, as you see, this is a reusable shopping grocery net, so no plastic bags. It's said on the site of the company that makes these that it's the equivalent of 700 plastic bags. So you get 700 trips to the grocery store, at least, out of this bag. Isn't it amazing? I think so. The company's name is Junes, or Jeune, Jeune, Je ne sais quoi, Je, Je, Junes, or Junes, Junes, J-U-N-E-S, and it's an amazing company that have these bags hand-sewn. That's right, they're hand-sewn by people in Mexico. So they have this organization, this bag, it's all about helping the world, not just environmentally speaking, when, you know, you don't use plastic bags and pollute everything, but also... These bags are hand-sewn by women in Mexico, in Juarez, Mexico, and then when they sell these bags, the company, they give back to the women of Juarez, Mexico through their organization, and their organization helps prevent violence against women, help women from violent situations, violent relationships, and they help prevent femicides, which is homicide of women, murder of women, femicide. Yeah, their organization is, you know, trying to make it less prevalent because apparently it's a really big problem in that area with violence against women and uh, murder of women. So this organization is really putting in the effort to try to turn those negative winds around and make things better for women. So I'm really happy about that because I don't think anyone should have to go through being targeted or vulnerable and hurt in the world. So equality, feminism, veganism, environmentalism, all in one bag. They come in all kinds of different colors just if you're wondering. And the link to the company is below. Just saying. 
that was what my Santa got me. I'm so stoked. I feel like they really went out of the way to try to find something that suited me, being a vegan feminist person. I really think they, you know, put some thought and effort into it. Thank you so much, Santa. If you enjoyed that video, you should check out my other videos. I have regulars every week. So I post two videos every week on the regular, Girl Talk Fridays on Friday, and Strain Sundays on Sundays. So yeah, check it out. And you know, subscribe so you know every time I post something new and spectacular. Thank you.